Dear friends, welcome to DB Infotech YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to teach you how to download and install Notepad++ software and also going to tell you one important use for computational chemist. So please watch this video, it is very useful for you. So if you like this video, please uh, like, comment and share this video to your friends and also subscribe my YouTube channel. So this is very useful to grow my YouTube channel. Now I will tell you how to download and install this Notepad++ software. Just go to google.com and you can type your Notepad++. This will direct to this page. So this is the first result. You can just click it. This Notepad++. So this is the Notepad++ uh, website. So this is a open source software. So anyone can download and uh, use this software. There is no need to pay any fees for this. So here you can see here on download option is there. Just you can click it download. So it will show a different kind of uh, download file. So I think this is the latest one. Download Notepad++. Just you can click it. So it will uh, show like this. Here you can click download. Just you can click it this box. So it will download. So this is the Notepad++ uh, installer for Windows. So go here. Just you can copy. Paste it on folder. So now just you can double click. This will start install. Just you can click OK. Then you can proceed uh, next. Just uh, you can click it agree. So it will ask the place. Then you can uh, click next. So then click next. So if you want, you can uh, this will create a desktop icon. Just you can uh, click it. Then you can click install. So this will automatically install. So then you can uh, finish. So if you check this box, it will run that software. So if you don't want, just you can uh, uncheck. So I will check it. We will see what happened. So, so this is the installed Notepad++ file. So this is the uh, installation procedure for this Notepad++ software. Then we can see how to uh, edit that uh, files using this software, especially the postcard file for selective dynamics. So this is the postcard file. If you are using VASP calculation, you may know this uh, postcard file. So if you want to do some selective dynamics, so it's very useful. So I am going to open this postcard file. So this is the postcard file of uh, some molecule. So if you want to do the selective dynamics, it's very useful. So the main use of this one is you can uh, easily copy the column and the row. So which part you want, you can selectively copy and paste somewhere. So this is the importance of this uh, video. So if you use a notepad, simply you cannot copy the uh, selective part in that uh, text. So so I, I will also tell you that one. So we will open that uh, uh, using this notepad. So open with. So this is the simple notepad. So you cannot copy uh, selectively from using this notepad. So you can see. So if you copy, it will copy everything. So you cannot copy the in single co column. So if you see, if you click like this, everything will select. So this is the drawback of this one. So if you use this notepad plus plus, is you 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 can easily copy column and row whatever you want. You can copy and paste wherever you want the selective place. So I will tell you this using this notepad plus plus. 
so here you can see so i will tell you how to copy the uh, column or row so for that in your laptop just press that alt button then you can use your mouse left side key just you can press alt and uh, press your left side uh, mouse so just you can uh, see you can select like this so just you can click you can see we we, uh, we can able to select uh, in this uh, uh, column of that uh, last one so you can copy this selectively so if you want to paste here so just you can control uh, v or you can uh, right click and paste it so it will paste so here so like that you can selectively copy and paste so if you want to so for selective dynamics you have to put that ttt for transition f f f for uh, the fixing the atom so this is for this also is very useful so just i can type f f f so just you can copy this using control c then you can uh, keep your cursor here so then you can press your alt button and you can select that uh, entire things or if you want up to your uh, selective dynamics you can keep here now you can control v or paste so the we are pasting you selectively up to where we want so we cannot uh, do using this kind of things using the notepad simply simple notepad so this is the importance of this one so here if you want to do some transition select this like this just you can copy so again press alt button and the mouse left side key just you can uh, drag like this so you can uh, uh, press ctrl v or you can right click and paste also it's fine so now we are selectively uh, putting that uh, fixing the atom and also the transition the atoms so well, this is the very important usage so uh, that's all so if you want to select that uh, uh, row you can also select so just you can press that uh, alt button and left click just see so simply we are selecting this uh, rows so then you can control v it will paste so see so simply copying and we are pasting a uh, selective part of this uh, one so we cannot do uh, this kind of things using that notepad simple uh, simple notepads so we can also see so we cannot do any selectivity in selective if so if we are copying this so if you want to paste here means see uh, somewhere pasting so uh, that, that's why i'm saying so if you are doing this uh, computational chemistry that uh, postcard files uh, this kind of things so you can uh, use this uh, notepad plus plus it's very useful and also tell to your friends to use this software it's very good only i'm using very long time yeah yes that's all so so we can conclude this video so thank you for watching my video if you like my video please uh, like comment share and subscribe to my channel thank you thank you for watching enjoy